Fantastic day because the hunky and dreamy founding member of 98 <laughs> Degrees. <laughs> oh, uh -huh. right. Okay, right. Okay. Jeff Timmons is joining us as our uh. special guest host. You like the hunky and dreamy? Well, together? yeah, that's quite an intro. Mm -hmm. I mean, usually I'm at home, so <laughs> right. I hear dad, a number of other <laughs> expletives that describe me. Right. So, you know, the hearing hunky and dreamy is. It's nice. It comes every once in a while. And you have five yeah. kids you're explaining. Uh, yeah, and wife. Five, yeah, I find that impossible to be. Right? How old are they? Uh, 16 down to three. Okay. So we have a mixed <laughs> family. I have two from my previous. She has two from her previous. And we have one together. So it really is like the Brady Bunch wow. in our house. This is oh, like a zoo neat. over there. So this is nice and tame compared to what right. I just came from. That <laughs> I can well, we all to. obviously know you from the popular boy band yes. back in the day. Tell right. us about that experience and all your travels. Oh, I mean, it was a, like a dream come true. I get to travel all over the world. Mm -hmm. I mean, do things that normally people don't get to do perform for different cultures experience different foods yeah. people uh, the, the best experience in the world I mean of course you get into it for screaming beautiful women <laughs> and, <laughs> and money and all that stuff and that's great but once it's you get perk. into it the music yeah. gets to be a, an amazing thing how it impacts folks different cultures different right. experiences yeah. things like that well, tell us about the music tell us about what, what what that genre was for you at that time how did it fit in your lifestyle well look I, I was inspired I, I never thought I was gonna be a singer I was in school to, to be a psychologist but I was wow. always in groups and things like that wow. on the side never really took it seriously but you know, boys to men came out and mm. I thought they were the most amazing group mm -hmm. on the planet right. and Tons they play of here one. all the time and, and I, right. we get to tour with them it was like yes. a dream come true for me yeah. a couple years ago we toured with them all over the country but uh, you know they inspired me and one day I thought man what if I started group like boys to men started singing for pretty girls at college and they liked it and I thought we were probably way better than what we really were quit school and went to LA to pursue the dream wow. and we got signed wow. singing backstage at a boys to men concert so yeah, it was kind this of comes out, yeah, this cool. comes at a time when boy bands are really blowing up yet in sync backstreet boys 98 degrees new kids on the block before that so yeah. where how did you guys stand out as 98 degrees you, you know we never thought of ourselves as a boy band and I don't think any of the boy bands think of themselves as, right. as a boy band they think of themselves as musicians right. and tried Absolutely. and true artists but you know we we were a true quartet that sang a cappella you know, we, we were signed to Motown that was our dream nice. label legendary wow. Motown records uh, and and at first we were really considered an R&B group I right. mean, in fact, our label didn't even put our pictures out there because sure. they wanted us uh, to be portrayed as an urban group, uh, you know, credible. Hence the tattoo. You're yeah, 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 that yeah, was wrong. Right. Right. Yeah, degrees. this was before all the, the <laughs> mall boy pictures and teen beat magazines. I oh, know I was into all of that. Yeah, right. in those magazines. But, you know, we did it because we were, we were an urban kind of group. But, you know, after we came out, pretty much the same time Backstreet Boys came out, and they were really exploiting their image, the way they looked, mm -hmm. and, and they were catering to, to younger. To the pop. To the young Younger pop yeah. girls and and our label was like wow we kind of have guys that look and sound like that why don't we do the same thing and so they started kind of marketing us towards what everybody markets pop music to right. teens and you're and marketing so. yourself in a whole new way now you've got the show um, the male review the men of the strip tell us about right. that right men of the strip where you well, I, I, I co-hosted the Chippendales, which has been a legendary, yes. successful male review uh, back in the day. And I was very reluctant about doing it, but it ended up being a big success. I, of course, I didn't strip in the show. And, well, and people came to not. see that. You put the bow tie on, when, when, guys look like this, yeah, when guys look like this, I keep my clothes on. So, yeah, you're just the host, right? But, yeah, I'm just the <laughs> lowly host, you know. Get but, out of here. But it ended up being uh, something that I thought we could take to the next level. Create a newer, younger, fresher version. Magic Mike came out, and I'm like, let's create a real version of Magic Mike, put together a great cast of guys, uh, went all over the country, toured with them 42 Followed cities. Followed you on E with that. Right. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks for yeah. getting knowing that. Yeah, yeah. He, he was, uh, well, I mean, I have a lot of help. I have a lot of help. And when you're with a, a bunch of talented people, it's yeah. pretty easy to do. I saw the reaction that these guys were getting. Yeah. We filmed the docu-series on it, end up being a movie on E, and now we're going to take the brand overseas and do it over Ooh, there. Nice. We're going to put together a cast of people from all over the planet, the hottest guys, the best dancers, best singers. Mm -hmm. Of course, they rip their shirts off and they're in good shape. Right. You and got the hottest guys. For, hottest TV, guys. for a TV show, yeah, right TV now. show. So. I'm glad you joined us. Thanks for having me. I appreciate it. We're going to get right into our trending topics. The results are.